Um, I just use All Maze Clear Confession Clear Complexion Concealer. Um, and I'm in color light 100. So I'm just going to apply this. blemish or discoloration and this actually has acne control in it so it will it has like medicated medication in it so it will also clear up acne and blemishes while wearing it okay so what I do is I take my uh, Eco Tools concealer brush and I kind of do a really quick gentle downstroke and kind of spread it around evenly and you know make sure all those little spots are covered. And it doesn't really have to be like perfectly blended that you're going to put foundations on too. And these Eco Tools brushes rock. I absolutely love these brushes. I did a review on them. If you're interested and you're thinking about getting them, go check out my review. I talk about all the brushes and show them to you guys. Okay. I'm going to go ahead now and also do my under eye concealer and I'm doing, I'm just using um, ELF's under eye concealer and highlighter. Um, I also did a review uh, on my, on this too. So what I do is just going to dot a little bit right underneath my eye, like almost on my cheekbones. Okay, might as well, I'll just use my finger for this one. So I just kind of gently pat it in. I also did a review on this. Um, I did an elf haul and um, a review on all my stuff. So if you're wanting, wondering about this, go check it out too. I have a lot of stuff. Okay, we'll get to the highlighting later. So what I'm going to do now is take my Eco Tools foundation brush and my Cover Girls Clean uh, Normal Skin Makeup. And actually, I have oily skin, but they were out when I went to the store. So, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to shake this up a little bit. Um, and I've noticed, like, on YouTube, a lot of people say that how they cannot um, get this out of the bottle. Well, this is also a new formula, but this is the creamiest makeup. And I'm not really a big fan of the whole, um, you know, bottled um, liquid foundation, but it works pretty good. I'm used to the, I usually use one of the pumps. So what I'm going to do is just take my brush and just gently, gently dab it into the makeup. and kind of just dot it all over my face. Okay. Um, this foundation is, um, you know, pretty good. And I always do my lips. It keeps my lips thick a little longer. Um, this foundation, um, is really cheap drugstore foundation. I only paid a dollar fifty for my whole bottle. So it's really inexpensive. And it works pretty good too. The only thing I really don't like about it is the smell. It smells uh kinda weird, but 
uh, once the foundation dries, the smell usually doesn't last. Like it, you can't smell it anymore. So, that's not too bad. Wow, the lighting is so bad, it makes me look orange, but I'm not orange. Yeah, I can't, I was actually going to do this um, video in front of my mirror, or my window. But I can't because it's stormy today. Like it's really cloudy and really dark outside. So I have to use artificial lighting again. And all of my videos, my lighting sucks. Maybe that's why I don't have that many viewers. Hmm. That took forever. Now, um, I'm going to set my liquid foundation with some um, powder and I actually use a tinted powder and um, it's by LA Colors um, it's just like basic powder um, I have uh, light I'm in the color light so this has like the uh, plate thing inside of it so I'm going to do put the lid on it turn it upside down and kind of shake it and this powder is actually really messy, but it kind of works. It works pretty good. No. I'm going to take my... Oh, my elf. My Eco Tools uh, All Over Face Brush. I'm just going to, like, barely dab it in there. Um, in the lid, where I have all, like, the powder. And then I'm just going to dump the rest of it out. And I'm just going to kind of squish it around in here. So I barely have any powder. And I'm just going to brush it all over my face. The thing about this powder is a little will go a really long way. So if you use too much of this powder, it'll make you look orange. Like, oompa loompa orange. So, you don't want to use too much of the powder. If you do it right, it does it does make you have this like really pretty glow after you're done and everything. And I know on the camera I probably look really discolored. But I think that's because of my lighting. The next thing I'm going to do is take my, if I can find it there, my e.l.f. concealer highlighter that you saw a little bit ago. I'm going to take the highlighting part, which is just like a little form of white stuff. <laughs> I'm just going to dab it right on the outside corner of my eye. Make a little C shape. And sometimes I'll do this before I put the powder on, but not always. And I'm also going to take a little bit and put it right here in the corners, inside corners of my eyes. I look kind of freaky. No. I'm going to take my finger and gently dab this in. I'm kind of going to just like make this C shape over here. And I'm going to run a little bit of it up here. My brow button. Okay, same thing on this side. 